Well, today the nation remembers the seven crew members killed aboard the Space Shuttle Challenger. On January 28, 1986, the Space Shuttle experienced fatal malfunctions upon takeoff and exploded 73 seconds into flight. Mission specialist and North Carolina A&T graduate Ronald McNair was on that mission. And every year the university honors his memory in a very special way. Dr. Daniela Gladden-Green is also an Aggie like Dr. McNair. She received a bachelor's in physics at North Carolina A&T and then now went to pursue your graduate degree at MIT and your doctorate degree at NC State. Good morning. Good morning. You are the keynote speaker for today's celebration. Uh, what do you remember about the Brave Q crew on board, including Dr. McNair, who died? Well, I was a sophomore at North Carolina a and at that time, and I had an opportunity to participate in the first tribute. And what I remember is the bravery. Mm -hmm. um, there was, of course, a teacher that was on board, and I felt a sense of pride in the commitment that Dr. McNair had um, as the trail that he was blazing, I was on that same trail. Right. That's awesome. And Dr. McNair obviously leaves behind an incredible legacy. What do you think that is? Um, I really think that um, he left a legacy of encouraging us to dream and achieve our goals and our dreams by acting them out. Um, he had a quote that is very personal to me, um, but applicable to all. And he said, in order for one to achieve their dream, you must first have one. And we're right here in between Dr. King's holiday mm -hmm. and the start of uh, Black History Month. Mm -hmm. And that is what I think he leaves. Take your dreams, write them down, and pursue them. And before you know them, it'll become a reality. Yeah. Uh, what do you want to say to young people, especially who will hear your speech today? I don't want them to um, focus so much on attaining a goal from the standpoint of what it will be when I get there. Mm -hmm. I would like them to understand that excellence in preparation is preparing them for excellence in performance. And those things coupled together will give you the fruit of prosperity. Yeah, and you're a trailblazer in your own right, um, having a U.S. patent and being a doctor. Um, what do you want people to know about your story and how it relates to other trailblazers like Dr. McNair? Well, again, um, it's the mindset that if you prepare properly, you would have to repeat things less. Mm -hmm. And so learn from others, learn from your mistakes, and before you know it, you will be living your dream. That's perfect. Thank you so much and well said. We can't wait to hear you today at the event starting at 1130 this morning. You can honor the life and legacy of Dr. Ronald E. McNair this morning at 1130. The 33rd annual celebration and luncheon will be held at North Carolina A&T State University uh, in the ballroom. The new student center will have all this information on our website, WFMYNews2.com.